The Drive Sober or Get Pulled Over program, a partnership between the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration and local law enforcement, aims to reduce the number of serious and fatal accidents caused by impaired driving in the state. That funds additional patrolmen that we're able to put out on the roads uh, looking for traffic violations, and that includes uh, speeding, seatbelt use, and distracted driving. Uh, throughout this time, uh, we're going to be focused on looking for impaired driving too. In 2023, there were more than 11,000 crashes involving alcohol or drugs that resulted in more than 500 deaths, according to the Michigan Traffic Crash Reporting System. Sanders says it's a problem that can be easily avoided plan ahead, have a designated driver, and if you find yourself in a position where you've had over three drinks, call for a ride uh, because we'll have officers out there uh, looking for impaired driving and other traffic violations. Sanders says getting caught driving impaired brings a range of consequences, which only get more severe if you hurt or kill someone while impaired. Being involved in an accident, injuring somebody or killing somebody, those penalties are substantially greater and you'll definitely uh, find yourself uh, with some jail time or prison time. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe to the WSBT 22 YouTube channel.